Welcome back to another episode of Forza Horizon 3. We are back here on a blizzard of mountain. And uh, today we are going to be tearing up the slopes in our G-Wagon. So this is going to be pretty fun. Obviously we do a lot of supercars and hypercars and all kinds of stuff like that in this game. And it's been a lot of fun to do those types of vehicles out here in the snow. But it's also kind of exciting to work with a vehicle that was actually made for this type of terrain. And it's going to handle it really, really well. So this is our G63 Absolute Beast. Oh my gosh, man. I missed this thing. I remember when we did our original episode. You guys can see we blacked it out. Kind of went with the Nate Shot style there. It's also got the red brake calipers along with the red T Martin logo underneath the V12 Bi Turbo emblem there on this side. Let's go ahead and uh, let's get in this front door. And see what this interior is all about. That diamond stitching on the seats, on the doors. Oh my goodness, man. What a beautiful car. Holy cow. Matt, you are one lucky dude. All right, anyway, we're going to go ahead and close the door, get this thing started up. Woo! We have put a lot of money into this thing. It's got quite a few upgrades, and uh, I believe it's. Is it S1 class? Is that what it was? I don't even remember, but it's gonna be a beast. Only thing we changed was we put some snow tires on her, and um, we're gonna see what we can do here. Ooh, look at that new wheel spin available. We aren't gonna do it yet. I've seen some people asking for some wheel spin videos, and uh, I'm saving up a ton right now. I I'm saving up so many. I think we have over 35 right now, and I'm trying to get even more. I wanna make it our biggest wheel spin opening yet, and um, we're definitely gonna do that here soon. But um, Right now we're at 115 out of 160 stars, and it looks like we have a completely new event we haven't even tried yet here. So it's, oh, it's a drift zone. I think we might we might want to want to save that one. I think we're gonna go back through with the the Ford Focus to do those drift zones. Yeah, lots of drift zones that we were looking pretty pretty slacking on. Oh, look at the, is this a speed zone right here? And it's Oh, you have to average. Okay, that'd be tough too. For three stars, we're gonna have to finish and win the race as well as get five landscaping skills. Now, I'm not exactly sure what landscaping is. I know it has to do with like wreckage of some sort, like taking out fences, taking out bushes, stuff like that. I think it's mainly fences that you have to look out for. So we're gonna try to do that. And um, I don't know, that one sounds pretty easy. Out of all the ones that we've done up until this point, I feel like that one, it's gonna be pretty easy, so I'm looking forward to it. After that, this episode may get a little bit difficult. We'll have to look at all the other events we have left, but I saw a lot of drifting zones, which is not really gonna be in the favor of this thing, but uh, we'll try our best. All right, here we go, guys. Let's start up our race event. Ooh, the snow is super thick up here. Okay, so that didn't even get us anything. I'm just trying to figure out what it is to start things off. Nice. Okay. That's one out of five there. So it has to do with fences. But it's got to be far enough apart. You don't do it back to back. Got the checkpoint and got another one. Nice. It is really hard to see. Woo! Oh, that one didn't count? Oh my goodness! <gasps> I need to be able to control this thing in midair like in GTA. Alright, we're good. 27% of the way through the race though, and we're currently pretty far back in the pack. It's not good. Oh! Okay, so those sort of fences don't count. The skinny fence. Shoot, alright. We're gonna have to restart this thing. The skinny fences don't count. The big wooden fences count, but you have to be going a certain speed and you can't hit too many of them all in one one go. Like when we come up right here, those won't count, but I think if we get all the way up here. Nice, there's one. I think we missed an opportunity for a second one right there. Let's try to take one of these. We missed the checkpoint though, I'm pretty sure. No, we got it, okay. Ah! Give him that fence, man. All right, we're up to three out of five. You, I actually can't see anything here. Whew. 
We just got four out of five. I'm not even sure how. But this is a good start. We also have to get first place, though, which is not going to be easy. Right? We're into fourth. We got first on our horizon here. Woo! Okay, we passed up first, but we do still need one more landscaping. What's it called? Bonus. I don't even know what you want to call it. Woo! Dude, this is getting crazy. We're on the ski slope area. I'm not seeing any of those big wooden fences. It's not good. Oh, there it is. Okay, so really any sort of wooden fence. Like, that'll probably count too. <gasps> oh my gosh, keep it up. Oh, <laughs> let's go. All right, we're hitting this and taking a left. Oh my god, we got it. We somehow got that with our back end. Our front end didn't even go through the checkpoint, but our back end did. Oh, dude, there were so many opportunities to get landscaping here. We kind of kind of forced it a little bit there at the start, but I guess that's okay. Wanted to make sure we definitely got it. Out of my way. <laughs> Just push him off. <gasps> Woo! So oh my gosh! Did we still win? Oh my gosh, everybody else crashed as well. I thought we were gonna fail it right there at the very end. I thought we were done for sure. No way, dude. All right, that was actually a really fun one. I enjoyed that, that was good stuff, okay. So, first race of the day, got ourselves some three stars. I like it, I'm gonna see you guys at our next event. And um, I guess there's no reason to, to cut here. Sometimes I end up missing those cuts in the editing and stuff. Sometimes I completely fail at editing. Like, I always like looking at the comments on editing fails. You guys always call me out. It's so funny. Anyway, here we go. What do we have next? So we drove all the way down to the frozen lake. And pretty much everything down here... Ooh, ooh, this one we haven't done yet. Lower Plateau Trail Trail Race. So it looks like it's going to be over to our left. And we're going to find out what they've got for us over here. It's not an ascent or a descent, it's just a trail race. And hopefully it's going to be some sort of a challenge we can actually complete here in the G-Wagon. This thing keeps wanting to flip over and then it just doesn't. It just keeps on going. It keeps going and going and going and going. Oh, we have an XP board over here too. Let's check out this XP board. Where's she at? 5,000, I'll take it. Got another wheel spin. We're saving those up. All right, here we go. Let's set up this event. 30 drift or e-drift skills. We'll try it. Oh, this is going to be an interesting one, guys. It looks like we're starting off on asphalt, too. Oh, no. We're going to get into the slick stuff. All right. Overall, this thing performs well in its class, so it might not be a, a bad one to use for this. One out of 30. I mean, things are going well so far. We're already at 10 out of 30 and we're only a fifth of the way through the race. 11, 12. 13. We just got 4 and one right there, boys, as we're passing second place. In the first, we only have 10 left. Wow, maybe we can do this. Oh my goodness, dude, that's beautiful. This thing is actually, who knew? This is going so well. I think one of our issues before with these drifting challenges is I always had ABS or not ABS, but uh, traction control and the other one on. Like, I always kept them on. 
Which honestly, I most of the time I don't even want them on in normal races. Sometimes I'll help you out, but that was messing us up with all of our drifting. So this thing, wow. Would you just look at that? It's actually a drift machine. Oh shoot. Tried to drift when it wasn't even necessary. Ended up hitting the tree. We're gonna be okay. Burst of Delaney, I'm not scared. Watch out for those thick trees and don't get knocked over. Nice. Alright guys. Alright. I'm digging it. Heck yeah. Who knew? The G63 is just an absolute drift monster, baby. Oh my gosh, that's awesome. We had a well over 30. This was like the perfect track for it too, though. I mean, it was just slow rights and lefts one after another that you could just link together. All right, anyway, there you have it. Two races, two three stars. Let's get it, guys. On to our next objective. I ain't turning right, girl. I'm gonna try to make it up this hill in the G63. Oh gosh, can we ramp this? Oh, we almost had it, guys. Come on, I, I believe she can do it. Maybe not at this speed now. We had some more speed earlier. Right, we're gonna see if we can go around this way. There's like a little. Little bridge across here through the rocks. Nice. You got it, girl. You got it, girl. Oh, my gosh. Look at that picture. Look at that photo op, dude. Look at that photo op, baby. We're going to go into photo mode. You guys have been enjoying uh, the thumbnails and stuff. I actually, I really like this. I think it's... I think it is amazing some of the pictures you can put together with this. All right. So, we're going to hide our UI here. Is that a good... Uh, is that a good thumbnail? What do you guys think? Should we go from that way or that way? I think from this way. Got the, the sun shining down. Colors in the sky. That looks good to me. All right, let's go, boys. Good stuff. So we're going to exit our photo mode. We're moving on to our next objective. It's a little circuit race up here towards the top of the mountain. We're going to see what kind of trouble we can get into. It's right here. Let's get it. The Peak Cross Country Circuit. What are our objectives going to be? 250,000 skill points. Well, we're going to try our best. All righty, guys. Here we go. Let's see what we can do. 250k is no joke. This is going to be a, uh, a bit of a stretch here, especially in the G-Wagon. But we're going to try our best. I don't know. I guess you never know. That guy's turning sideways. Oh, no. I think we have to start off. We have to start off with a... a Multiplier. We are gonna. I, I don't want to. I don't want to start down. Our first one. I want to make sure is our best one. What do we have here? Three laps. Yeah. So I want to make sure we get off to a really good start. So I'm gonna try to stick behind these guys, not land on top of them. Get some drafting. Oh, we just land on top of them again. Ultimate passes. Never mind. Okay. Okay, this is good. Get some destruction. Grab one of these signs. Come back across. Oh no. See, what do we get here? What are we about to get here? Some e drift action. Nice. Oh! Some ultimate air. Oh my gosh! Okay. We're gonna need some wreckage here. We have some landscaping. Ooh, side swipes. Landscaping's nice. Oh my gosh, dude, are you serious? That same stupid little rock, it got us last time, too. Oh my gosh, I tried to throw a little drip there at the end because I wanted to keep the multiplier going because we were on a good, a good run. And that stupid little rock, it's like hiding behind this big brother rock. You don't ever see it until it's too late. Okay, so we were at like, I think we were around kind of like close to 100k there. I'm not even sure. Get a little bit of air there. Nice. Give me a drift tap. Oh my god! 
What are you telling me? A 50-50 grind doesn't count as a bonus on another car? Come on, we're in a G-Wagon. It's meant to do that, right? It's essentially a monster truck. All right, let's try this again, guys. My goodness. Holy cow. Okay. Let's see what we can do. We're going to try to keep it somewhat chill. That's not even our fault! We couldn't even see what was happening in front of us, and then all of a sudden we land on the bottom side of a Range Rover. All right, let's try this again. My goodness, you can already tell this is gonna be a, this is gonna be a challenging one. I don't know, I think if we could have a good start and kinda solidify our position in the pack and not deal with all of this crap that happens. Like the Range Rover that's upside down again, it's the 28 Days Later Range Rover. You're supposed to be a zombie survival unit and you can't even take a little jump in the snow. How are you gonna survive the zombie apocalypse? All right. I think we're gonna, I think we're gonna ramp off to the left. That dude is still landing sideways. Still sideways. All right. So get over here, get some drafting in. Get some black ice. New steering control of the vehicle. No! Yes! Oh! No! Oh! Jumped over him! Paul Walker maneuver, baby! We've been getting a lot of those lately. Nice. Barely kept that one alive. Yes! Wreckage? Yes! Okay, 60,000 to start off. I think that's something to work with. I think we can work with that, but I think we can do better. I'm gonna let it ride though. We'll see if we can, we'll see if we can make something out of this. Okay, side swiping, great drifts. Some more wreckage. Oh, we gotta get to this jump. Come on, come on. Don't end, don't end, don't end. Yes. I hate it when they end in midair. Yes, side swipes and wreckages. Let's keep it chill on the jump here. Woo! Oh my gosh! All right, I was trying to keep it chill because I didn't want to. I didn't want to hit the jump too hard and end up losing it. You know what I mean? Because you can easily do that. Let's come over here and get some wreckage. As long as we can still get that checkpoint, which we did. Keep in mind, we're going to be able to get first place, too. Oh my gosh, another 86,000. Dude, we're going to have our work cut out for us, man. I, we're, we're going to be really close, but we're going to need 100k after this, man. 3k. Like, stuff like that's just not going to be doing it for us. We're going to need a lot more than that. We're going to need a huge skill chain. 1K? We're going to need 100K to end off on this last lap. So we're going to need a 20K times 5 is going to be our goal. Let's see if we can knock that down, boys. Start throwing some shapes. Throw that booty out there. I mean, I'm not saying it's impossible, but she ain't gonna be easy. Some of that, nice. Get the ice. No, 20K. Come on, man, I want it so bad. We need a 70K. We're out in front, so we're getting all of this. The landscaping, the everything. Oh my gosh, 
Yes, dude. No, we're not gonna get it. I, I honestly, I feel like this is a bit too tall of an order for the G wagon. I, I think, I don't know. It just, it's not keeping up the speed that it needs. Like I can't, I can't keep the speed in the, the drifts. I can't keep the speed going to get to the next section to continue it, to get that next piece of damage that we have to do, to get that next whatever else we have to do. I think it's possible, but I think it's very, very hard. Got another 14,000. Yeah, we're going to be about 50,000 short, so. That's all right. Sometimes you win some, sometimes you lose. We knew that this was going to be a really tough episode, especially in the G-Wagon, so I'm not upset with it. I mean, we... Here, let's... Let's get 200k. We got 200k out of 250. That's not too bad. So I'll take that. I'm going to see you guys at our next episode. I think this one we're going to have to chalk up to doing in like the Kinblock Focus or something like that. And uh, I'm going to catch you guys later. Peace out.